For more than six years now, iShow has been one of the most visible ways that ASME fulfills its mission to advance engineering for the benefit of humanity. And today, we're thrilled to announce one more. Hello, everyone. I'm Kathleen Lobb, Executive Director of the ASME Foundation and Managing Director of ASME Philanthropy. iShow has built an incredible record of success in helping bring to market extraordinary innovations that address the UN Sustainable Development Goals. If you're a social entrepreneur with a brilliant prototype and need help scaling it up to a market-ready product, you couldn't ask for a better vehicle than iShow to get you across the finish line, or in the case of many early stage companies, the starting line. But what about all the world-changing ideas that aren't quite to the prototype stage? To answer that question, I am delighted to introduce Keith Rowe. Keith is a past president of ASME and currently chairs both the Philanthropy Committee and our campaign for Next Generation Engineers. Keith, welcome. Hi, Kathleen, and hello, everyone. I've been looking forward to this moment for over a year, ever since the ASME Foundation decided to help fund a new program that builds on the success of the iShow. For those of you who have been involved or witnessed an iShow, you know firsthand exactly what that success means. Right now, social entrepreneurs look to iShow for help in getting their vetted prototypes to market. But what we know is that they also need help much earlier in the process, moving from the very early concept stage to building a working prototype, a place to explore, develop, and improve the most promising ideas for social development hardware even if those ideas are still largely untested and not fully formed. That's what ASME's newest initiative is all about. It's called Idea Lab, uh, where select powerful ideas from social entrepreneurs are chosen to move through a rigorous process to ensure that they're fully viable, manufacturable, and will make a difference. And most importantly, Idea Lab can help ensure that life-changing innovations don't get stalled on the drawing board if you will, for lack of support. Keith believes so strongly in this extension of the iShow program that he and his wife, Elizabeth, nicknamed Brownie, made a generous lead contribution to get Idea Lab off the ground. So on behalf of the ASME Foundation, and more importantly, all the aspiring social entrepreneurs who will participate, thank you, Keith, for investing in this exciting new initiative. Well, we look at this as an investment in the future. I've seen our incredibly innovative products that have come out of iShow. Our hope and desire is that Idea Lab will be sort of an incubator for iShow, where they get the help they need to advance to the prototype stage. The concept is that the best ideas will see, receive early seed capital, technical expertise from ASME volunteers, and even business guidance to move from concept to working product, prototype and of course, then on to iShow. And once that happens, these innovations will change a lot of lives all over the world. Brownie and I are just thrilled to be a part of that process. This program has so much potential. We hope some of you will consider joining us in supporting this work. Thanks to the Rowe family, the first Idea Lab will take place next year. But there is so much more to do, and the world just cannot afford to leave any brilliant idea behind. If you'd like to support Idea Lab, uh, give us at the ASME Foundation a call or visit the donate page at asme.org slash donate. And to learn more about the Idea Lab program, you can visit the iShow website, thisishardware.org slash ideas.